This is why I pick SEO over PPC almost any day of the week. Hey everyone, I'm John Timmerman and I talk about the world's most exciting brands and marketing trends so that both you and I can grow our businesses faster. And today I'm going to explain why I love SEO over PPC almost any day of the week. Now, full disclosure, I run an agency called Good Monster and we do both. We do SEO and PPC. We do Google ads, we do Facebook ads, we do TikTok ads, we do Snapchat ads, we do LinkedIn ads, we do all the ads, okay? But if I were to put SEO next to PPC, I would pick SEO. Now, let's look at SEO, right? Search engine optimization. It can be somewhat expensive depending on the industry that you're in and how much competition is there, okay? It can cost you anywhere from maybe like $1,000 if you're a small kind of local or regional company all the way up to $20,000 plus if you're a you know, billion dollar, multi-billion dollar Fortune 500 company and you've got multiple brands underneath you and you're trying to get first position for all of those, right? So the scale is, is wide, but it can be expensive and it can take a long time, okay? SEO can take three months up to a year, again, depending on the industry that you're in. Now, it won't take a year for it to work or do anything, but it can take a year to really get some drastic results if you're in a super, super competitive industry. And the work is not light. You have to actively work every single day, all day long to try to get and fight for those first, uh, those first page and first number one, two, three, four, five rankings in Google organic. But the reason why SEO is such amazing investment is that it sort of lasts forever or basically, right? So as long as you keep maintaining your SEO and you keep doing the basic sort of white hat, you know, good SEO technique things like writing really good content that people like to read, structuring it in a way that Google can read it and index it well, making sure that your web pages are structured properly and all the technical SEO is done and you're actively trying to get people to link back to your blog posts or your websites on a regular basis. Basis. All of these things are sort of uh, SEO maintenance 101. And if you do that and you can maintain your first page rank uh, uh, in, in number one, two, three, four, five ranking, then you're going to get a lot of leads. You're going to get a lot of revenue depending on what type of business you are. And it's just going to come in organically, right? Hence organic marketing or search engine optimization being an organic uh, marketing strategy. Now, when comparing that to Google Ads, let's say, okay, Google, Google Ads and, and Google SEO, you have to keep paying for it. So although you can get highly effective Google Ads, you can get Google Ads with a 5, 6, 7, 12, 15 return on ad spend, okay, that's a highly profitable uh, activity, marketing activity. As soon as you stop paying, it's gone right? It's a pay to play operation. And it's the same over on Facebook. It's the same over on TikTok. And it's the same on, on Snapchat or LinkedIn or any other platform. You pay to get your ad in front of their audience. The moment you stop paying, it goes away. With SEO, you pay and you pay to get that result, but you don't have to keep paying more to get better results. Okay. You pay the same and you keep working and you keep working and you keep working and your results get better and they get better and they get better and they get better. Okay. And then once you've maxed out your results, you can try a different niche. You can try different keywords. You can try different pages. Okay. And you can build on that, but the cost really sort of just stays the same. All right. That is the main reason why I love SEO over PPC. But as I said in the beginning of the video, they both have their place. Okay, think of the first page of Google. You have your Google ads at the top, and then depending on what you're searching for, you either have like a little local pack right here where it's recommending local businesses, and then you have all your organic results, all right? If you're not searching for a local uh, uh, type of company like a restaurant, you're searching for a product, then you're gonna get shopping ads to show up underneath the Google ads, okay? So you have Google ads and then you have shopping ads. Sometimes you have the shopping ads right at the very top, and then you have your organic results. Either way, you've got the ads at the top and the organic results underneath that, all right? So running ads so that you show up at the top is valuable. And then doing SEO so that you show up underneath that in all the places that are relevant 
is valuable. We call this blanketing the first page. You wanna do this on Google, you wanna do this on Amazon. You wanna blanket the first page so that when people search for whatever it is you offer, they see you, they see you, they see you, they see you. And if you wanna go one step further, which we're not gonna cover in this video, but affiliate marketing is a way that you can fully blanket the first page of Google because you've got ads that show up at the top and then you've got your organic website that's showing up if you're doing your SEO really well. And then you have all these best of sites, right? Best lawn care companies in Syracuse, best shoes for baseball, uh, best shirts for comfort, right? All of these best of blogs are typically affiliate blogs. And so if you can get your products featured in affiliate blogs, now you've really blanketed the first page of Google, okay? So SEO over PPC because it's sort of a consistent payment for increasingly valuable results and growth. PPC, you can grow, but only if you pay more. Not directly, right? You can always increase or improve your cost, decrease your cost per click and you know, increase, improve your, your uh, relevancy score, right? But typically, once you've got that set, you've got to pay more to increase your sales, to get your ad out in front of more people, okay? So that's why I like SEO over PPC. What do you think? Do you like PPC better or do you like SEO better? Leave a comment below. And as always, subscribe if you like talk about business and marketing. That's all I do on this channel. And if you need help with your PPC or your SEO or your affiliate marketing, check out my agency, thegoodmonster.com. We do this every day for our, all of our clients who we love, and we would love to talk to see if we could help you. So thegoodmonster.com. See you in the next video.